this is Stampy, and welcome to a, a brand new Let's Play on Super Mario Odyssey. I am playing this at midnight, basically on the, the night before it came out, because I just couldn't wait to, to play, and I've been looking forward to this for ages. So let's start. In the skies above Peach's Castle. Of course, every single Mario game, pretty much every single Mario game, starts with Bowser normally stealing Peach, and then us going on a journey to, to try and save her. That is... One of the the constants in the, the universe of Mario, I guess. But everything else around the, the side changes as well. We're not going straight into a boss battle, are we? Are we going to be going straight into to battling Bowser? This is the end for you! Oh no, my hat! Can't have Mario without a hat. If you don't know anything about this game, and I don't know loads, uh, I always try to, to not watch too many videos or trailers or anything before the game comes out, so I don't want any uh, spoilers, but basically, the star of the show is basically Barrio's hat. I think he's called, like, Kappa, the hat. No, 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 not the hat. So basically, you can throw your hat at... Oh, wait, sorry, one second. It's time for my wedding with Peach. Jealous Mario. <laughs> so yeah, basically you throw your hat at things, and then that uh, basically makes you almost become that thing by the looks of it. It basically gets a little moustache, and then you get to control it. Oh no! The hat just got shattered! Well, there's a little bit of it left, I guess. And then is this a, a boo with a fancy hat has, uh, has come to, to gather it? It just looks amazing. It just looks amazing seeing like a, a proper 3D Mario game. And I know there there was 3D Mario games on the, the Wii U, but not kind of like a, a full open Mario game like this. I'm used to seeing Mario in pixelated style rather than like this. And oh, we're in. We are in. Moving around. Look at the, the little hand just floating in the, the corner of the, the screen. I have a little bit of a look around. It recommends to, to play it with the, the Joy-Con like separated. I've decided just to, to play with the, the standard kind of pro controller What is uh, is what I prefer. But right, I can look around, I can run, and I can jump. There we go. They are the, the main controls that you're going to, to need for any Mario game. And oh yeah, you can do like your triple jump where you go jump, jump, and then jump, and then you do like a flip and you're able to, to jump higher, which is a, a really cool way to, to do it. What's going on with the, the world though? It's all it's all black and white. This isn't the the colourful world that I expected to join in. Oh look at the fancy frogs! Why is everything so fancy? Oh, I got a coin from it. Oh no, I took its hat off. I made it less fancy. I de fancified the frogs. <laughs> I got a coin out of it though. I just wanna I wanna set it so the it's inverted if I can uh, change. I was not gonna struggle. There we go. So let's set that to, to reverse. Sorry, not inverted to, to reverse. Uh, there we go. <laughs> look at the menu. Boop 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 boop. I think that, that's my favorite one, the, the sneaky Mario. <laughs> sneaky Mario. Anyway, sorry. Back to the game. Back to the game. Back to the game. Who who are you? I'm Mario. See, they don't recognize me because I'm not my hat. You're not one of them, are you? One, one of what? This is the uh, this is the one that was able to, to get my, my hat. And oh, it's got the eye. It's kind of like Kappa has. Oh no! So 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 sorry for running away like that. You you startled me, and I, I I do startle easily. I saw what happened earlier. You've been through quite the ringer. You've landed in the Cap Kingdom. We've been under attack by the same Bowser monster that gave you such such trouble. And to make matters worse, the fiend has kidnapped my little sister. <laughs> Oh no, he's just kidnapping everyone. He's on a kidnapping spree today. That's two kidnappings he's done before breakfast. I, I hoped to give chase to that m m m monster in a ship of my own. Unfortunately, all of our airships were wrecked in the, at the attack. Oh, although now that I think of it, I'm fairly certain there's a functioning ship in the, the next kingdom over. I could get us there if only I could reach the, the, the top hat tower which is being guarded by the monster's henchmen. I, I know, it seems we're after the same thing. Perhaps we should team up. Let's see if we can help uh, the, 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 those two. Oh, my hat. <laughs> Hey! I mean, it's not really my style. No, 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 not your style. How about this? 
Ah, okay, and then this is going to be the, the story of how Kappa came into to existence. <laughs> I'm glad that they give it to you straight away. I was worried that, you know, it's going to be a while until you get it, but it looks like I'm going to have this power right from the, the beginning. Cappy is your companion! Oh, and isn't he adorable? Uh, try throwing me with Y. Okay, what shall I throw it at? Throw it at the, the light? Oh! Oh, I turned the light on! Okay, so I didn't become the light, but I did turn the light on. I wonder if I if I turn all these lights on, do you think it will do something? Okay, it didn't do anything. Can I like how do I ground pound? Uh nope. Oh 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 I did something! I I think I oh I think I threw the, the cap at this uh this post. Okay, is that how I make these things drop down? If I go a little bit closer? Ah, so the cap kinda like grabs onto it and uh, and then pulls them all back. Okay, let's go and uh, grab a few more of these coins. It wouldn't be a, a Mario game with, uh, without coins. <laughs> and all right, I can really like rapid like throw it as well, especially if it doesn't seem to, to get anything. I can use it to destroy crates uh, as well. Very good to, to know. Uh, there's a few more sneaky crates hidden down here. So a big part about Mario games is about finding all of the, the secrets. Ooh, for example, this little sneaky place down here. And oh, is, is, is that him advertising the wedding? A royal wedding, yeah, we'll see about that. I guess I can uh, get rid of some of these uh, these posters. Do you reckon I can break away these? I can! I can break away the, the posters uh, with Kappa. It looks like they're, they're pretty generous in terms of me not actually completely hitting the, the thing that I was aiming for, but it still seems to, to get it destroyed anyway. And there's got to be loads of coins. Look at this! Who put the, who put these coins here and then just covered it in a bunch of boxes? I'm very glad they did because I was able to, to scoop them all up. But ha, I am just kind of wondering the motivations of uh, whoever did that. Let's go down here and uh, go and grab some more of these uh, these coins. I probably don't need to, to worry about too many coins earlier. Oh, look, a bunch of water came out from uh, from down there. What's going on with all of these guys around here? Is this just like a uh, a kingdom of, of just hat people by the looks of things? And oh, I got myself uh, another heart then uh, as well. Can I talk to these people? Ah, I can. I can see the monster minions from here, but all I can do is float helplessly and watch. Well, no worries about that, because me and uh, and Cappy uh, are going to, to push in to, to hopefully be able to, to save the, the day. But first, we're going to go and gather up a, a whole bunch of coins. So it looks like if I if I kind of just um, do it right next to something, I basically just do a spin attack. You see that? I just hold Cappy and just do a spin attack. And whoa! There's a bunch of like, little ones. <laughs> they went all over the place. Oh, what was that? Oh, so I used Cappy. So it looks like... like I use Cappy to basically interact with everything in the, the world. I really like that. That's cool. I haven't really played around with my other controls. So, throw cap. So, it looks like X and Y are both throw, uh, throw cap. Uh, you can also shake the pro controller to, to throw. Okay, that is uh, something I'm probably never, ever going to do because... <laughs> why would I Why would I do that when I just press a button? So, it looks like there's really only two buttons. So, X and Y both throw the, the hat. And then B and A. I know it doesn't really mean anything to you, me saying this. But uh, B and A seem to, to both... Um, to, to be able to, to jump. So, so far it looks like there's only really two controls to, to play around with. But oh, I want to take them away. Why won't they let me take them over at all? <laughs> I could crouch it as well. Uh, I use, uh, press R to do that and L does that as well. Can I slide if I sprint and then kind of, not like a, a big slide, but if there is somewhere small, I might be able to fit through with that. What do you reckon the chances are I'm going to make all of these flowers appear and then something's going to happen here? I can see that there's there's something there's something there that's going to, to happen. So if I do it really fast, and oh, I was able to, to get a, another heart. I guess because I got full hearts, it just gives me a bunch of coins uh, instead. Anyway, we need to, to try and get that airship, but it's being taken over uh, by the, the minions. So it looks like we have uh, ourselves a bit of a, of a tower to, to climb first. And oh, I can use uh, Cappy to, to go and do the blocks. Of course I can. Cappy seems to do literally everything for me right now. <laughs> and then I need to jump my way over to here. Can I swim? I can swim. Of course I can swim. And oh, the water looks nice. Doesn't the water look good? Look at that. You've never seen water like that in a Mario game before, have you? And what about the frogs? Oh, it's happening. I'm becoming a frog. It's happening. I'm being sucked inside the frog! <laughs> oh, I bet I'm gonna be able to swim like really well now. Yeah. Poor Mario. Poor Mario. He didn't wake up this morning knowing he was gonna become a frog. Oh, look at the giant frog! It's so crazy. They're like really realistic, just like real life pictures of a, of a frog. And oh, my eyes are opening. I am one with the frog. <laughs> well, I wonder what special powers this is going to be able to, to give me. Apart from looking like the fanciest frog in the world. You captured a frog. Okay, so I can I can dash. 
like this? Am I am I dashing? Is this me dashing? I don't seem to be dashing. Uh, shake the pro controller for whoa for a high jump. <laughs> I mean my my jump seems pretty high anyway. Right there, looks like I it looks like I kind of needed to be the frog. So swimming seems to be easier as the frog. And oh no, there was a there's a one that I missed down here. Can I <laughs> can I get this as the the frog though? I don't I don't know if I can. I think I'd have to to go back to being Mario. And I don't even know how to, to do that. And I'm just having too much fun as the, the frog anyway. Right. It looks like, yeah, it looks like I had to, to become the, the frog. Because I'm going to have to jump up here. And I don't think Mario would be able to, to jump that high. I can jump really high out of the, the water as well. It's pretty impressive. And oh, no. Oh, there's Goombas. There's Goombas. Um, I, I, haven't, I haven't mastered my dash yet. I'm, I'm, I, it said move. Oh, do I have to push the saddle stick? No, I'm pressing... I'm moving and I'm pressing Y, but I don't seem to be doing any dashing. So let's just try and jump on the, the little Goombas. Do these even hurt me? I don't know if these ones even hurt me. These are like little, like tiny little baby Goombas. So I don't think I even need to, to worry too much about them. It looks like we have some, some froggy friends. Like what do the other frogs think when they see <laughs> Hattie Mustachy Frog showing up? What do they, how do they react? Do they care? Oh, I can still just bounce on them and get coins from them. I love the fact that just everything in the Mushroom Kingdom has, has coins in it. Well, I guess we're not in the Mushroom Kingdom. We're in the the hat kingdom or whatever <laughs> this place that is called <laughs> right i gotta go and shake the controller around. i'm gonna get tired playing this game if i have to keep shaking the, the controller non-stop uh well it looks like this um this box i will be able to to get because i can bounce it from uh, from underneath and now i can go and jump my way up here let me just test if i if i walk into them yeah like, i just squished them that's not me jumping that's me just walking into to them so it looks like these goombas are going to be no problem at all i can just go and uh, start building up my collection of coins oh got myself another heart as well let's go and uh, and grab that and keep jumping my way up to the the top and speaking of the top i do believe we've arrived so uh press uh lz to return to to normal right Oh, do I have to do it? Release capture. There we go. Oh, I'm free! Okay, that's really quick to, to do as well. And now uh, we can go and grab these coins. And how do I open the, the chest? Can I open the chest? Oh, I can. A huge heart. Oh, that's giving me like an extra three hearts of health. Which kind of worries me because whenever games give you extra health, it normally means that you're going to need the extra health. So <laughs> we've got to be uh, looking out for, for what we're going to be going up against next. I guess this is a, uh, a checkpoint. Uh, we were able to, to get there. That monster has ruined everything. Bad days to happen, but you've got to keep a stiff upper brim. Can't you do something to help us? I'm trying, I'm trying. Who could be responsible for this? I'm so scared I can hardly move. Well, let me let me turn a light on for you, and it will uh, it will cheer you up. <laughs> Are there any secrets behind here? Nope. I'm really just trying to keep an eye out for uh, self for secrets. Oh, should I have a little look around the the back here? Oh, there's a, a huge trail of of coins going up there. I will be going back to to grab them soon. Oh, I got a random coin from nowhere. So I believe this just all links around to the um. The, the other side. So I don't think there's going to be any, any bonuses over there. So yeah, let's just go and, uh, and head back up here. Are the coins... Did the coins stay? Oh, I didn't lose the coins, did I? Oh no, I, th I think I should have run up. I think the, the coins just went and disappeared. It's weird having a compass in a Mario game. You don't normally need a, a compass. But right then, we've arrived at the, the minions and the the world's smallest airship by the, the looks of things. So let's see if we can take them out. Oh, what are they? They're bunnies. There are a bunch of bad bunnies that we need to, to go after. Ha ha! The monster bus warned me there'd be a fella with a mustache coming along. Guess we ought to introduce ourselves. We're the wedding planners for the happy monster peach princess couple. They call us the bunny 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 brothers. We got that uh, copper princess treasure we need, so we ain't got no business in these parts. Of course, roughing up goody two shoes, Metas was in the contract, so I guess we still got ourselves a little works to do. Right then, am I going like me against all of them, or it looks like we're going 1v1? Right. Do I have to hit his? I think I need to hit his hat tops. I feel like the, the hats are the source of all of his power. And then I can jump on his head. There we go. Big splash. And now I can go and try and grab the coins. I need to do it avoiding these hats though, because these are spiky hats. I love the way just everything is themed around hats in this game. It's, <laughs> it's kind of special. So do, oh, do I need to, to get my... To get, ah, I do. I need to take them out, not just to avoid them. Right. Let's go and take them out. And then here is the... Uh, the, uh, the the rabbit brother back. Let's knock him on the, the ground. Boink him on the head. No, stay still. There we go. Okay. I, I hit him with my hat to make him stay still. And then he moved again. Oh, no, no. Sit down. Sit down. And then boink. <laughs> Did I take him out?
Right, am I gonna have to go up against all of them though? Or have I scared the others off by my impressive display of hat flinging? I believe I've scared the, the others off. So do I need to, to jump on this? Most impressive. Now let's use this wire. Oh, are you, I'm using their voice. Most impressive. But now let's use this wire to make our way onward. Oh, do I just jump on the wire? Do I jump on the wire? Do, oh, no. Oh, I think I got to become electricity. I think I've seen this in one of the trailers. So I think if I throw this at the hat and then, yeah, I am now going to become a Mario version of electricity. <laughs> it's literally like a ball of electrons with a hat and a moustache. And that is going to be my way I travel into town. And there we go, the titles. Super Mario Odyssey. I cannot begin to tell you how excited. There's a reason I have stayed up until midnight just to, just to play the game, just to at least see the opening before I go to bed because I have been looking forward to this game from the moment it was released, even before, before blah, blah, when it was announced even, and even before it was announced because... Obviously, when they released the Switch, I knew they were going to be releasing a big new Mario game. And then when I saw, it wasn't the first trailer, but it was the first trailer that really showed Kappa. And you kind of taking things over and just the music. And have you seen the trailer that they that they did, which was like a real like live action song? It was like a whole musical and stuff. And just the music and the look of the game and everything. I was so excited. And even now, even though I'm uploading this the day it came out, there's been a bunch of reviews and they're basically all giving it 10 out of 10. So yeah, we're in for a, we're in for a treat, guys. Anyway, woo, yeah, w -w -w what a ride. We made it to Cascade Kingdom. S -s 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 Sorry, still a bit amped up from cap 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 capturing the power line. Must collect myself. There should be an old airship somewhere around here. Let's see if we can find it. So it looks like we weren't able to, to get the, the other airship. And this is what I was expecting the, the game to look like. I was expecting lots of bright, colorful areas. We're in a waterfall basin by the looks of things. Can I become a parrot? Oh, please let me become a parrot. No, let me become a parrot. No, come back. Let me become you. I want to be you. Oh, I can look around in first person view. Jolly good. What are these? Are these like tips then? Maybe I'm going to throw my, my hat at it. Oh. Ah, then they uh, pop out to, to become a, a big thing. Oh, there's a, a notice over here. What does this say? Can I read it? Uh, I can read it. Travel tip. Uh, homing cap throw. After throwing your cap, shake the pro controller again to perform a homing cap throw. Your cap will fly towards the nearest target uh, you can see. It's super handy when your aim is a little off. What are you trying to say, game? What are you trying to say? Ah, ah, what are these guys? Uh, can I throw my can I throw my cap at these? I guess I should try homing. Let's try and purposely be a bit of ah. Okay, I don't like the fact I got to shake the controller. Is there a way to do it without shaking the controller? I might look to to see if I can change the the controls. I don't know. I've never been a fan of motion controls. Um, I mean, it seems to to work fine uh, in this case. But uh, yeah, I will see if I can turn them off. But I'm sure it'll be fine at all. Ah, right. Was this like, ooh, well, there's purple coins down here. What do the purple coins do? I have no idea, but uh, there's some little platforms we can do here. I don't know if these are going to disappear after time, so let me go and try and get up to the, the top of them quickly. And oh, right, there's a, a chain chomp guy here. Oh, I can become it. Of course I can become it. Oh, can I smash this? So, oh, ah, I see what I need to do. Well, let's let, oh, I need to get out of the way for starters. <laughs> and then I need to, to get on top of it. So I need to pull this way. And then release and send it flying and smash my way through. And all one of the moons. I think they're like the, the main collectible in this game, of course, other than coins. So let's try and sneak our way around the, the outside here and then go and, uh, and grab the, the, the moon. The, the very first moon of my collection. You got a moon. Our first power moon, they, uh, they seem to, to be called. So what, what, do I, what do they do? Can I use them to, to do anything? Or are they just something fancy to have in my collection? I'm sure they must do something. I just need to, yeah, need to, to work it out. Multi-moon atop the falls. Oh, what's this guy? Oh, is there another one of the, the, the bad bunnies? With like, a, it's got like a gold chain chop. Oh, we found a power moon. What a lucky break. This will come in handy to power the airship. Have you seen ever anything like it? Oh, so I need to, ah, I reckon it's going to, to be a case where they say like, ah, you need to have five power moons in order to, to go to the airship. I reckon that's what it's going to be used for. Ah, there it is. This is what we were looking for. It's looking a bit more rough than I expected. Ah, no, it's just uh, an older model. I'm certain it can still fly. Let's give it a shot, shall we? Just throw me on that globe there. Well, so what, what is the, what is this the airship? 
I don't really quite quite understand how this is going to, to work, but let's uh let's see if we can work it out. So maybe this is like the, the main hub, and then from here we go and uh, and travel to, to all of the, the other worlds that we're going to, to visit. Ha! Huh, nothing happening! That's Power Moon just uh, not giving the ship enough energy! I wonder if we can find more around here. It's exactly what I expected, so we need four more. We need four more Power Moons uh, in order to, to go and move on to the, the next area. So it looks like we have a, a little bit of, a, of exploring to, to do around this area, but sadly, and it is very much so sadly for, for me and you, I am going to, to have- Oh, come back! Oh no, come back! Come back, coins! No, come back! There's so many of you! Yeah, I'm gonna go to bed, because as I said, <laughs> it is very late as I'm recording this, but I will be up early tomorrow, as early as I can, uh, to be continuing recording, just to make sure there are plenty more Super Mario Odyssey videos coming up soon on the, the channel. So yeah, let me know if you enjoyed this uh, this episode, let me know if you're gonna be playing the, the game uh, yourself. I'm gonna leave, of course, uh, as always in the description, all of the, the details about the, the game, uh, in case you wanna find out more uh, about it, and if you have a, a Switch, maybe pick it up for yourselves. But sadly, as I said, this is the end of this episode here. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye!